Welcome to ClickMyProject.com. Our product title is a performance investigation of a 4 switch 3 phase inverter fed induction motor drives at low speeds using fuzzy logic and PI controllers. Let us see about abstract of our product. In this proposed implementation design is using fuzzy logic controller for indirect field oriented controller of induction motor drives fed by a 4 switch 3 phase inverter. In the proposed approach the induction motor drive system is fed by a 4 switch 3 phase inverter instead of the traditional 6 switch 3 phase inverter for a cost effective low power applications. The proposed FLC improves dynamic response and it is also designed with reduced computation burden. The complete IFOC scheme incorporating the FLC for induction motor drives fed by the proposed 4 switch 3 base inverter is built in MATLAB simulating environment. The dynamic performance, robustness and insensitivity of the proposed FLC with 4 switch 3 base inverter fed induction motor drive is simulated and compared to a traditional PA controller under speed tracking load disturbance and parameter variations particularly at low speeds. It is found that the proposed FLC is more robust than the PA controller under load disturbance and parameter variations. Moreover, the proposed 4 switch 3 phase induction motor drive is comparable with the traditional SSTP induction motor drive considering its good dynamic performance, cost reduction and low THT. Next we see about flow diagram of our product. In this flow diagram the input source is a AC supply that that AC supply is fit into converter switches and capacitor. Here the purpose of converter switches is converted into AC to DC. After that that is fit into 4 switch 3 base inverter. In this 4 switch 3 base inverter is converted into DC to AC. Then the AC supply is fit into induction motor. In the induction motor is a sensor based induction motor. So the speed and current is sensed by using of sensor and that values are fit into current sensing controller and fuzzy logic controller. Uh, in that uh, current sensing controller and fuzzy logic controller having a comparator. That comparator is compared with the actual value and reference value then creating a signal and that value is fed into hysteresis controller. In the hysteresis controller having one PWM generator, in that PWM generator is generate the pulses according to the output from the fuzzy logic controller and current sensing controller. That pulses are fed into 4 switch 3 base inverter IGBT switches and also converter IGBT switches. Next we see about running process of our product. In this proposed implementation is done in MATLAB 2013 environment. First we open the MATLAB window and create the new model file. After creating the new model file, we create the elements as per the circuit diagram. We arrange that elements as per the circuit diagram, then click the run symbol icon. Then after that the corresponding output will be displayed in the corresponding output scopes. First one the input voltage is getting from the uh, input scope and next one the current is getting from the input current measurement and next one the DC voltage this is the uh, converted from rectifier side. After that DC voltage is fed into the input of inverter that inverter is a 4 switch 3 phase inverter in that inverter that voltage will be converted into AC so here is a AC output voltage and next one is the AC output current and this is the pulses is generated from the Kasteris controller and it this is fed into inverter and converter IGBT switches and next one the uh, motor speed and torque is getting from uh, induction motor side and next one the rotor current and IA, IB and IC and also IQ and ID. IQ and ID is nothing but that is a direct and quadrature axis values and next one rotor flux and stator current, stator current in IA, IB and IC and next one the stator current 
and also DQ values. The DQ values already I told direct and cartridge value and also the state or voltages. And final, this is the FFT analysis. Uh, what value of harmonics will be eliminated in the overall circuit? In the overall circuit, the harmonics will be eliminated and also that value is 6.39 percentage. Overall, the total harmonics will be eliminated compared to the conventional methods so the efficiency will be increases by eliminating the harmonic distortions thank you for watching this video